right. Let's oh, check it out. out. I'm gonna press the power button to start the camera. I'm gonna press the menu button to start with the menu. We have four options. Mode, setup, connecting to the TV, and another setup. So let's go start with mode. In order to enter into option or make a selection, you have to press record button. Mode. We have four modes. Shooting movie, taking pictures, time lapse, or live recording. We'll be sticking to recording video. So press and enter. There we go. Second option. Setup. And that would be a setup for the video. We have currently 1080p. And we're going to make a selection. We have 1080p at 60, we have 1080p at 30, we have 720 at 30, we have 720 at 120, we have 480 to 40, and we would prefer the highest quality possible, that would be 1080 60. 1080 format, 60 would be frames per second, if I'm not mistaken, and uh, MP4 is the format recommended to use for social media, online uploading, YouTubers, bloggers, vloggers. So stick with MP4 for now, unless we need something better quality to process certain type of video clips. Next will be uh, the stabilization. Active, standard to off, above it active, at stage door and optical. Active, steady shot. Balance, active, steady shot. Boss, balance, optical, steady shot. There you go. We get that and we get, uh, we get the hardware to work and we get the software to work, basically. Next. The selection of the view on the camera when you're recording widescreen medium or narrow so we'll be looking at the white screen recording so stay with white zoom digital zoom on the camera no we will not be using digital zoom so we will go with option off next option is flipping the camera view so that it doesn't have other flip like on the iPhones or or tablets, you have to flip the camera manually if you're using it upside down, let's say mounting on a bike or on a car upside down, you have to flip that in order to have it recorded in the correct format, otherwise you have to flip it again in the software before uploading it. Hopefully you got that, that was a little bit too quick. Next, that's already for more professional shots, if you want to play around with uh, light or any other options, you have lots of options here to record in, so uh, I'll stay with what's already selected here, which is preset to zero, preset to uh, standard, no fishes here, that's for sure, and then flat downs, otherwise you can do different presets. Uh, picture recording quality is it going to be a neutral or vivid we'll go with vivid or natural vivid so vivid would be a, a brighter colors and a sharper image i would believe that as from my experience but uh, everybody is uh, have a different opinion so neutral natural it will be more natural and that means uh, a more flat colors more uh, there's no bright colors there would not be uh, uh, much detailed lines, so uh, I would recommend to go with it. But check it out. Next one, microphone. Are we recording? Yes, we are. So we we'll use a mic. Next one, there will be uh, the assistance of the software to reduce the wind noise associated with 
to win and get onto your mic and create some noise. So if you do on, it will cut uh, certain uh, audio channels or audio frequencies, but uh, it will not be a quality sound. So we'll go it off. And another recommendation, a uh, little piece of foam, rubber band, and uh, you get the professional mic uh, filter right there. All right, that's it for now. Last option. Next option will be connected TV. So if you'd like to watch your videos or slideshow or anything like that, you connect the TV to this option. And the last one is uh, the actual camera hardware uh, software setup. So software, hardware, both. Main, main game. Let's go. Airplane mode. No, thank you. No, not right now. Wi-Fi. Yes, please. Currently for one camera. Hi, Wi-Fi. Used for the remote. No, thank you. Bluetooth on. Yes, for on and off controls of the camera, you need Bluetooth. Next, uh, there you go. Power control of the camera. Available with a watch or any other devices. Sure. We'll leave it on. Satellite, that's GPS. Okay, let's have it on. Format dial. On a call, I really don't want to do that. We have some videos already. HDMI would be the format, high definition. HDMI, there's all. EMP, okay, I like. 60 frames per second, thank you. BGM is the music. Basic. We don't need that. Leave it alone. Background music, that's what it is. USB charger, yes. Sounds are off, so there's no beeping. You can sound this is with it. Alright, next option is recording lights. How many red lights would you like camera to display while capturing the footage? I'm picking the one in the back. Alright, and the next option in the camera is a one-touch recording, one button recording. That means you can only press one button and the camera will start capturing the content from the last use setting. The button is the one with the red dot on the top. Not off. There you go. I have an automatic option off in 60 seconds in case you forget the camera and it's not going to drain your battery. NTSC to Paul. We're currently using NTSC system, which is the US Canada system. Paul will be for Europe and uh, I believe Asia. So we'll stick into the American system. That's the type of recording format. Next one would be the time and the date, which we already have preset. Thank you. Yes, today is the May 29th, and it's 2.47 p.m. GMT is 5, minus 5, that's Toronto. Let's go to the last option once again. That's the airplane mode, that's the meat, that's the Wi Fi mode that we need. That's a high Wi Fi mode for the remote control. We don't need that's a Bluetooth. We would use it for the control and the power of the camera. And that's a control from your watch, I believe, or any other device. Power control, we'll leave it on. This is a GPS format, the card, which we don't need. Format is HDMI, 1080p 60 frames per second. This is background music, which we will not use. USB charging is set to on, in case you charge USB, it's charging the battery. The sounds are off, so it's not beeping while we're using the menu. And uh, one light while recording. Recording light will be on. And, oh, that would be for one, one, button recording that would be yes that's a one button recording option the manic shut off in 60 seconds uh american to european format we use an american ntsc power to european format or asian there will be set up a time there will be the zone and there will be the daylight savings version and reset that's it last menu all right menu review is over and that's the end of the review guys. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed the video, please like, share and subscribe.